The world is a little less bright. He was pure magic as a human and an artist. Job less and guide you sweetly home, my friend. Roll all your windows down, Randall. Crank up the music. Rons, This Is Us co-star Sterling K. Brown, Mandy Moore, and Susan Kalichi Watson, all devastated by the death of their friend. In season one, the scene where he passed away was one of the show's most powerful. Come on now, breathe with me. I kind of watched it at home by myself, and uh, it moved me just as much as it moved all the fans. We talked to Ron just after 10 million people watched the emotional episode. Sterling referenced the episode in his statement, saying, life imitated art, and one of the most wonderful people the world has ever seen is no longer with us. It was a really powerful moment to have that opportunity to be there. And so, like, I would look at you, and I would see you, and I would see my dad. They reflected on their emotional scenes together. All those scenes are almost pseudo-therapeutic, and we both know as actors, one of the bravest things to do is to be able to open yourself up and let a lot of that personal stuff come to the fore. Ron is survived by his daughter, Jasmine, and in 2017, he told us it was hard for her to watch the scenes where he was dying on the show. It's difficult for her to watch a lot of those stuff that I'm going through in, yeah. the, in the episode. She, she, um, it's almost too real for her? Yeah, I think so. One of his earliest roles was in the Denzel Washington film, He Got Game, playing a prison guard. But of course, he most famously played Randall Pearson's biological father for six seasons, as so much of the show was told in time jumps and flashbacks. Were you surprised by what a heartbreaker this one was? I wasn't surprised, but I mean, it was breaking my heart all the way through. It moved me in the same way as people are expressing to me that it moved them. Ron suffered in silence for years from pulmonary disease and received a double lung transplant in 2020. But he ended his career where it began, on stage, returning to Broadway in 2021 to star in Clyde's.